just two races to go. So much anticipation. Carifta out of the schedule 2020, 2021 lands back on earth in Jamaica. And everyone I've spoken to, Maurice, happy to meet us back on the schedule. Definitely happy it's back. Uh, athletes have been waiting two years for this. Last time, 2020, when COVID hit, many athletes were very disappointed. The season just came to a complete halt, a dramatic halt. And now it's back. Everybody's excited. Competition is back. Track and field is back. We want to run. We're here. Lane three appears to be empty. That's where Trinidad and Tobago were set to run. Bermuda starting from lane number eight. We'd have Bob in their team, third in the 400 meters, and gold on the 17 in 2019. The Jamaicans will go in lane number six. Or Bahamas, sorry, will go in lane number six. British Virgin Islands in five. Jamaica in four. And then in lane number two, the Turks and Caicos Islands. Their great hero, Delano Williams, World Junior 200 champion in 2012. On your marks. Final of the under 20 girls, 4x400. Four the 400 herders champion, Safia Hines, leading off the Jamaicans. Turks and Caicos on the inside. Set. Final girls event of a career to 49 here, here in Kingston, Jamaica, the 4x400. Very good start for the British Virgin Islands. They have a Krista Eristi on the opening leg. Outstanding competitor Eristi. A 400 silver medalist at the under 17 level in 2019. But the Jamaican Sapia Hines comes right up to her, the 400 hurdles champion. And they go to battle. Has been in great form this season, Hines. Comes past the BVI and hits into the straight through the lead. A fight back for Aristi in the blue and the red. The British Virgin Islands athlete, Akrissa Aristi, responds and powers away from Sapia Hines and gives the Bermudans the lead and gives the British Virgin Islands the lead, sorry. Jamaica in second position. The rest left well back. Bermuda, down the back stretch they go. Anika Makanoff chasing for Jamaica. And the BVI have put the pedal to the metal here on the second leg. BVI and Jamaica. The Jamaicans with Mackinac under pressure though. This is a strong leg for the BVI, but Mackinac edges ahead for the Jamaicans and moves further away in the closing stages. The Jamaicans have Shaquille Green, 400 hurdles medalist on this leg. Mackinac 52-4 pulled Jamaica's fat out of the fire with a determined second leg. Green pumping down the back stretch. British Virgin Islands back in second position. No Kelly Kelly, the 400 champion for the Jamaicans, remember. And so they have an 800 runner on the anchor leg. But it's a big lead that she will have. And it will take something special to catch her. Shaquille Green produces a fine penultimate leg in the under 20 girls 4x4. And now Rashana Dwyer has the baton. She gets a chance to leave Karifta in a blaze of relay glory. 55-6 for Green on the third leg. Dwyer 
comfortable on the back stretch. A little bit of a of redemption, you can say, Hubert, trying to get this goal, trying to get this medal, because one was denied her earlier. Roshan Adwar for Jamaica. British Virgin Islands well beaten now. They are way back in second position. Bermuda, I think, in third. Dwyer turns for home. Glances back. But she's well clear. Roshan Adwar closes her Carifta career in relay glory. A golden moment, 3.31.85 on the clock. 3.36.9, yeah, no 54 way. flat for Roshana Dwyer to close out her Carifta campaign. No way that was 3.31. Clock stopped early. There is confirmation the Jamaicans strike gold. Seven out of seven in the relays for the black, green and gold, the Bahamians. Coming across the line now. Dwyer anchors Jamaica to gold. 3.36.81, the official time. Excellent leg by Onika Makanoff on that second leg. Really brought Jamaica back. A little bit in front. And then Shaquilla Green just extended that lead. Very little for... Dwyer to do but she again extended her lead and Jamaica secured a goal BVI in second and Bermuda held on for the bronze yeah they had Caitlin Bob on the anchor leg and once she got the baton in middle position she was always going to maintain that the British Virgin Islands ran well they were smart they gave the opening leg to a Krista Ariste their best runner they also had Kayla Leibard in the setup as well and they were able to hold on for the silver medal but the Jamaicans victorious once again another look at it Safia Hines leading off for the Jamaicans Eristi leading off for the British Virgin Islands and the flat 400 runner gave it to the Jamaican 400 hurdler She's been so good at 404 hurdles this season. Rescued her team with a sensible, solid, and swift second leg. And Green did the business on the third leg, 55.6, to provide a cushion not needed for Roshana Dwyer. Then fitting for Dwyer to end her Carifta career with a gold medal. If you get appointed coach of Jamaica's World Junior Team to Cali, Colombia, this is a useful 4x4 option, the speedy 800 star, Roshana Dwyer. 7 out of 7 in the relays for the Jamaicans. One to come. Three thirty-six eighty-one for Jamaica, British Virgin Islands second. Three forty-five six to seven, Bermuda front. Three forty-eight six to nine, Bahamas four oh five ninety-nine in fourth, Turks and Caicos four twenty fifty-one, finishing in fifth. You wait for it for three years, 